and then start going for power as this one is going to be a banger on that side. Ah. No mummies. A banger. Uh, what is up guys, it is Esteban from Exquisite Football here and today I'm going to show you three steps to improve your weak foot. ¿Qué onda chicos? Hoy les vamos a enseñar un video de tres este, pasos para mejorar tu pierna este, izquierda o derecha que no sea tan buena. Bueno, a empezar. So for step one, it's to juggle with only one foot. Like this, only one foot. Or if you need improvement on your right foot, just that. So yeah, it's every single day, every single day like this. Only one foot juggling, one foot juggling. Boom. Even as it comes, and then go to the other way, the other way, like that. Or if you need improvement on your right foot, same thing. Boom. Boom. All right. So yeah, you get the idea. Juggle every single day with only one foot with the foot that you need improvement on and that's basically it for step one. So step two is just dribbling with one foot that needs improvement. Same step as the juggling. Just que no es tan buena, empezar a, a gametear, a cambiar de lado, de lado a lado, así, nada más con tu pierna que necesita ayuda, así te cambias, te cambias, boom, cortas la mitad, te vas así derecho, y ya, es el paso 2 que debes de seguir cada día para mejorar esa pierna, y sí, ok, so guys, step 3 is very simple, with your weak foot, step up to the ball, Six, penalty, and the 18. Those are your three distances that you have to practice every single day to improve your weak foot. You have to hit it as hard as you can with this, and from each single step as you go. Just run up to it. Now for the technique, I would recommend uh, a punt or a goal kick, just, just to get used to it. Put it behind the, put it, put it underneath the ball. Just getting used to that movement of uh, doing a, a goal kick. And then you can start worrying about power. Just make it feel comfortable and nice. Be confident. Three. Go for power. Now for this one, it's more important for curve and placement. So not a lot of power for this one. Just, yeah. Diamond. This diamond is really useful, especially for these uh, visions that have a lot of grip and show that diamond, that area of uh, contact that you need. And just keep practicing that. Hit like two lefties and two righties. That. So now that you've mastered the penalty spot, you can add some flair to it. Like most people like players like Hazard, Messi, like to run up the ball. You can try different run ups, but it takes a little bit of time. So just keep practicing, like do a little jump. That. Ah, that was bad, but <laughs> you can see how hard I hit it and the curve and the technique that I use. But that was a bad shot. C18. 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 If you wanna be a free kick specialist with your lefty and your righty, practice, practice, practice. For far post, it, because I'm trying to work on my curve, it works for your technique as well. So, your setup, very different. You wanna be like this, so you create more curve. That's pretty good. I'm just gonna dribble and then shoot. Robin. It's also, you're also combining what we did on that drill over there. It counts. So, you just implement that, just shoot. 
go up from anywhere. We usually have some distance to it. Just start with your left, dribble, dribble, drop. Oh, that will be a banger. That is it. You implement all three steps, and that's what you get. But of course, it takes time, practice, and yeah. Thank you for liking it. Uh, sorry. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, those are the three steps to improving your weak foot. Just remember to practice, practice. You implement all the steps, the juggling, the dribbling, and finally the shooting. Uh, but yeah, thank you for liking and subscribe. See you next time. Thinking about your day and night, but I won't let you go without a fight.